89 TCM shop. Hi there, thanks for joining us. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. October is always a celebratory month on TCM. Halloween at the end of the month gives us all the reason we need to reach deep into our library and bring out a selection of the best and most frightening horror films we can find. Tonight, a lineup of movies featuring haunted houses. So stay up with us all night long, alone in the dark. We're gonna kick things off with a lesser known movie from 1965, two on a guillotine. As the story begins, we meet a magician, John Harley Duquesne, played by Cesar Romero. Duquesne is about to pull off a nifty trick with a guillotine, but then something goes terribly wrong involving his beautiful assistant, who also happens to be his wife. I don't want to give away what goes wrong, but it does involve a guillotine, so use your imagination. Cut to 20 years later, and Duquesne's estranged daughter returns to collect her inheritance. But first, she must spend seven nights in her father's creepy old mansion, a mansion that appears to be haunted. The cast features Connie Stevens and the late Dean Jones, who just passed away last month. But for fans of classic movies, perhaps the most interesting name in the credits is the producer and director, William Conrad. Conrad began acting in movies in the 1940s, playing some wonderfully memorable character roles in some good movies, starting with the film noir classic, The Killers. Conrad later moved to television, where he not only acted, but produced, directed, and sometimes even narrated. It is Conrad's voice that gave viewers the backstory of Dr. Richard Kimball before every episode of The Fugitive. As a director, Bill Conrad had a reputation for doing a lot with a little, and you'll certainly see that here in this low-budget production. Oh, and watch for Conrad making a Hitchcock-like cameo. He's the portly man in the House of Mirrors scene. From Warner Brothers in 1965, the first of many horror films you'll be seeing on TCM this month, Two on a Guillotine. 